So as you guys know, last week on Monday, we were introduced with the title update 1.0.2, which introduced a bunch of bug fixes as well as enhancements to the game itself. And in that article, we were specifically told that the next update 1.0.3 would be available at some point several weeks from that day. Well, it looks like yesterday over on the forums as well as on Reddit, Ubisoft went ahead and announced that they will be pushing out a very small update tomorrow on the 22nd, which will begin at 5 a.m. if you live in the eastern side of the United States. Now, like with any of these updates there is going to be a short period of downtime usually for the title updates it's about three hours but for specifically for this live update it's only going to be a 20 minute downtime now the big question on everybody's mind is going to be what exactly is going to be introduced with this small update and for starters some changes were made to the battle reward system that a lot of you have been requesting so in the background right now i'm going to show you guys what are the three changes that were made to the battle reward system i'm going to show you guys the forum post that ub borgo posted and here we see three major changes being made to the battle reward system for starters the daily cap is going to be increased from 400 to 600 starting tomorrow october 22nd now keep in mind that this is just the live update it is not update 1.0.3 so this is sort of a temporary change for the time being because starting on title update 1.0.3 there will not be a daily cap for the rewards so keep in mind that the daily cap increase to 600 is just a temporary thing because once the next title update drops that will be completely gone and there won't be a cap anymore now as for the other thing mentioned here it says the live update will also increase the rewards for faction support missions from 15 to 30 points so definitely some really good changes to the battle reward system i wish they would have been here from release because i would have been a lot deeper within the actual battle pass but definitely in my opinion a good change in the right direction now unfortunately those of you that did play for the early access release if you went ahead and purchased one of those time savers where it increases your daily cap to 800 there hasn't really been any word if you're going to get reimbursed or maybe get your ghost coins back i know there's probably very few that actually went ahead and purchased this but if you did the moment that they do put out a statement talking about any type of reimbursement i will update you guys as soon as i see that now as for the second change that's going to be introduced with this live update is in title update 2 they fixed an issue where players were getting a repeat item in the battle reward system which was the nightmare brown karambit so if you were affected by this they're going to be granting players who were active before the release of title update 1.0.2 another item which is going to be the fury brown karambit to make up for the repeated reward so again nothing major no new content none of that stuff but they did address an issue that a lot of you were very vocal about being the battle reward reward system i know that individuals with normal lives at work and go to school are just not able to get on every single day to accomplish these daily caps and honestly it just wasn't fair that they were being punished just because they weren't able to get on because of life so definitely a step in the right direction and i'm really excited for the next title update at least at this point we can now confirm one change that will be coming in the next title update but anyways the moment that you guys are watching this video the update will be live so go ahead and enjoy it if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like on it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all types of breakpoint content really quickly i want to say thank you guys so much for all the support on my joker video i got plenty of easter eggs and little secrets that you guys are sending me every single day either on twitter or on discord so thank you guys very very much i will be covering those in the channel at some point and with that i also want to make it clear that i am feeling a lot better so thank you guys so much for every single one of you that reached out and sent me prayers and sent me to get well little by little i'm recovering but i'm getting back to normal and that's all that really matters but anyways that's gonna do it for today's video like always i will see you guys in the next one.